Hey, yeah, I'm here. That is Alan Wong in a recent narrative drama film, In the Life of Music, a story about the intergenerational impacts of the Cambodian genocide on a family, told through a song, Champa Bat Nam Bong. The 35-year-old Toronto actress plays a young American girl who visits her relatives in Cambodia for the first time and wants to record everything she sees for her dying refugee mother back in America. I told her everything I see, she sees too. You played the lead role of Hope in, in a live music movie and coming in, what was your expectation? Um, I was going to be working and shooting in Cambodia and I knew that it was going to be different there. Um, not just because, you know, I'd never worked there before, but also just there were going to be so many emotions and feelings and, and things that were really close to home for me. In the 90-minute film, her character Hope gets to learn about what her mother went through before and during the Khmer Rouge, a communist regime that killed 1.7 million people in the late 1970s. In the process, Hope rediscovers her own roots and identity. In the Life of Music is such an important film because it is about the history of what our parents went through, but it's about the journey of a girl who's really got her foot in two different worlds and is trying to fit into both and make herself um, feel whole. Alan Wong was born in Canada to Chinese Cambodian refugee parents who fled to Canada because of the Khmer Rouge genocide. Growing up, she said she didn't meet a lot of Cambodians and her parents didn't really talk about what happened to the family. Wong said she sees herself in the character Hope. I know, for, at least for me growing up, I wanted so much to just fit in and to be just feel like I was like everyone else around me, that I wanted to be as you know, as Canadian as possible, like as Western as possible. And so there is sometimes that gap where you feel like you try to push away your your true like identity, the thing that makes, the part that makes you who you are as well. And um, knowing about the, the, your family's history, I think is incredibly important and is part of who you are and is something that needs to be continually passed down. My first trip back to Cambodia in 2007, I did my uh, my own backpacking trip there without my without any family. And, um, and I really felt like she was on that same journey that I was on at that time. You don't really quite understand it until you visit Cambodia and you're there and you feel the, the country and the people and the culture and the history that there's this moment Oh, I get it. I get, I get my, I get my family. I get my parents. I get why they are the way they are. I get why I'm the way I am, and it all kind of pieces together just by being there. And that was something I felt the first time I went back by myself, and that was something that I really wanted to bring for hope. Not only did the 2007 trip prepare Wong for her acting role in In the Life of Music. It also allowed her, she said, to understand why her parents didn't want her to pursue her dream to be an actress. It comes from this place where, you know, you've your families had to overcome so much to be where they are and you just want to have this certainty for your children and, and know that they're going to be okay and, and to not take that huge risk, like just go get that job that's going to guarantee that you can work and be comfortable and and not have to ever worry um but my trip back to cambodia was what made me realize that um my parents were coming from a place where dreaming was a little bit of a different story like you know they didn't have a chance to dream you know to take that risk to have a dream and to pursue it meant if you failed at it like that maybe that was over maybe you only had one chance and so they had to work really hard to 
to just to work and survive. Whereas for me, I realized it was different, you know, like they came to Canada so that I could have opportunity. And I was, you know, young and still figuring out what, who I was and where I was heading. And that meant that I was able to take risks and make mistakes. And even if things didn't work out, I still had the chance to figure out another way that it was not going to be the end of everything. In the life of music, which was selected as the Cambodian entry for the best international feature film at the 92nd Academy Awards, is scheduled to be available in DVD format before the end of 2020, and the first 20 copies will come with an autographed vinyl soundtrack. Chatra Chap for VOA News, Washington. Mm -hmm.